Hey, what's up, everybody? How's it going? So from the thumbnail, you know we are talking about um, the Miel Seamoss Anti-Shedding Collection. Y'all, so um, I'm excited about this because, you know, um, I never really tried any of Miel's uh, products. Oh, okay, the only exception is like, my sister, she kind of is into her stuff. So, like, if I'm at her house and I need to fix up my hair or, like, fix something in my hair, I'll go in her stash and get whatever she has. And sometimes, most of the time, she has Miel. I'm so unfamiliar with Miel. I don't really know the collections, but I think she had, like, a pomegranate one. I know it was, like, a pinkish, purplish containers. And I remember using that, and that smelled good. And it, it was okay, but it really wasn't so impressive that i needed i felt like i needed to try it try it um but i only tried it because i needed something right then and there but anyway when i was at the beauty supply store this collection caught my eye because it's CMOS. and you know CMOS is all trendy right now um it's been trendy for a good minute uh, but because of its health benefits like it's just out here in the public and so uh Last year when I went on a cruise, uh, I went to like um, St. Martin, St. Thomas, the Bahamas, and I ended up picking up some like raw sea moss and I still have some here in my bag. <laughs> I, it was like sold by, I guess, you know, um, in this area where they just kind of sell a bunch of stuff. So it was like a bunch of restaurants there. Um, it was like an outdoor in the like in the states we call it like a flea market, but I don't know what it's called over there. But it was like an outdoor place where they was just selling everything, you know, souvenirs I guess for the tourists. Um, and like they had a spice. Uh, the tour guide that we was with, he was like his favorite stop is to stop way at the end of I guess that part of the island. He was like, it was a spice shop down there. So I went and I bought like some cinnamon and some um, pure vanilla flavor, I guess like vanilla, you know, uh, and I bought, uh, I can't remember. I bought a couple other spices, some curry to like a couple different kinds of curries. And then I also bought some sea moss. So here is, here is the sea moss. I don't know how to prepare it. So I am going to YouTube it. I just been having it. My, I gave my sister a pack because she is into this stuff. She prepared hers and she said it was really good because she's very familiar with it. And she was like, oh, you got real sea moss. They didn't like <laughs> whoop you or whatever. So, um, but yeah, so since I had this sea moss all this time, you know, I, especially with me being on the diet right now, I'm like, this is a fine time for me to grab this sea moss and do something with it since I purchased it. And when I was in the beauty supply store, they had this sea moss collection. So I'm like, I know sea moss is good for your body internally and stuff. And I see people do sea moss face mask and all that stuff. What is like, how good is it for your hair? Um, and since Miel had this collection already whipped up for us, you know, I was like, hey, let me go ahead and try it. So we're going to get into the review. Um, and at the end, I will let you guys know what I think about the whole collection. Mind you, again, this is my first time using Miel stuff. And uh, yeah, so I'm just going to let you get into it. If you're interested in seeing what my thoughts are, just stay tuned to the video. And before I roll the wash day footage thank you guys for tuning in if you are returning thank you for coming back if you um are interested go ahead and like this uh subscribe to this channel and at the end don't forget to like the video if you found this review very helpful for you and um leave me any comments that you want to below let me know have you used this collection are you planning on using this collection if you happen to know a good video or a good way to prepare <laughs> raw sea moths <laughs> let me know tag me in and help a sister out because i have no idea and i really want to um enjoy that sea moth so again here we go 
Okay, y'all. So we're going to go ahead and get started with wash day. And I wanted to go ahead and show you guys how the packaging looks. So this is the CMOS um, shampoo. It says it's anti-shedding and infused with Sopomato. Um, That's the conditioner. It says the same. I also have the gel hair mask. And I also have um, the curl pudding. So I'll tell you guys about that later. But all of them says that it is anti-shedding infused with salt palmetto and it eliminate frizz and add shine so i went ahead and took off the wig show you guys the condition of my hair um it was in a wash and go for the first half of the week and then i just threw this headband wig on for the remainder of the week because wash day is sunday and you know i'm not touching my hair until sunday after i do it so this is the condition of it. So it has some gel, of course, edge control. It's dry. I did not reapply any product to it whatsoever. So this is the first wash. And look at that shampoo. It is nice and creamy. It smells really, really fresh. Fresh and clean. It's a fresh, clean scent. I really I really like the scent. It's light, um, but it's um, potent enough that the fragrance seems like it's going to last. And look at that lather. Like, my hair is dirty. It isn't extremely dirty. But, like I said, it has gel and edge control and stuff on it. And it's dry. And it just immediately, you know, became all sudsy. And I really, really, really appreciate a good sudsy shampoo. Because, to me, that just makes me feel like it's enough soap uh, ingredient in there that, you know, can help clean all that residue and all that stuff gook off my hair so i'm um, going there scrub the scalp make sure everything is all nice and clean now her shampoo says um enjoy close your eyes and enjoy the relaxing softness of miel sea moss anti-shedding shampoo this super rich shampoo will hydrate every single strand as it seals in moisture it contains anti-shedding properties that will work to promote longer, stronger hair. Sea moss removes product buildup, leaving hair soft, clean, and moisturized. The lightweight hydrating formula is packed with nutrients to deliver vibrant results, perfect for all hair types. This shampoo feels great and smells divine. Is that say divine, girl? Pair it with Sea Moss Anti Shedding Conditioner for an amazing wash day experience. So, of course, they always say pour a small amount in your hand, massage in your hair, work it to a rich lather, rinse thoroughly, and repeat for best results. Follow up with the Sea Moss Conditioner. So, um, this condition, this shampoo, look at, look how good it is. I hope you guys were watching while you was listening to me re rant on about how the enjoy part, but I can actually detangle my hair with shampoo. And y'all know, if y'all watch any of my videos, y'all know how I feel about detangling my hair every step of the way in the wash day process. Like it just makes the end result so much easier if I can detangle my hair while I'm shampooing, detangle my hair while I'm conditioning, and then detangle my hair after my deep condition. Like it just make wash, it just make the styling process so much easier um, for me because it cut down my work. I'd rather detangle every step of the way than to wait until the end to detangle. And this shampoo delivers like it won me over just by that. Like I was just so impressed by like the slip, how moisturizing my hair feels, how soft my hair feels. It was good. Like, yeah, I really, 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 really enjoyed this shampoo. Like this wash day was pretty easy because of the properties and the consistency and everything that this shampoo gave. Like, look at all them suds. Like really, really, really nice. So this is the second wash. And um, so like the first couple ingredients says is water. Um, they have some disodium, I guess. Um, so the iris sea moss is probably maybe six down. Um, so to me, that 
seems like it's quite a bit of sea moss in here. And salt palmetto uh, fruit extract is right after the sea moss. Um, it has some algae extract and all this other stuff. So anyway, I just say that to say that uh, sea moss is within the first 10 ingredients on here. It's not like the first couple, but it's probably like six to seven down. So this is the second wash again. And look at that. It's just, it shows, it's giving clean. It's giving like your hair is clean, girl. You got bubbles everywhere. Uh, yeah, it ain't nothing more you need to do. You need to just go ahead and rinse this stuff out and let it be because it's clean. So that's what I'm about to do. And then we'll talk about this conditioner. Okay, yeah, so let's get into this conditioner. So first, take a look at how clean my hair is. Um, the curls is popping. They are pretty clumped together. My hair is soft. It feels really, really moisturized. My elasticity is there. Like my hair springs right back. Um, and my hair just smells amazing. It smells amazing. So I'm just going to try to go ahead and part it down the middle a little bit and show you guys how clean my scalp is. Like it's just, it, it was really a really cleansing shampoo, even though it was like ultra moisturizing. It's not really a clarifying shampoo, but it, it gets it pretty, pretty clean and get that product build up off. So here is the conditioner um, and it, it's the same. It's the anti-shedding um, conditioner it's infused with salt palmetto, uh, salt palmetto um, and it is like pretty much um a lightweight conditioner it it's not super thick and it's not thin at all but um you know like it's it's lightweight I, that's the best i can describe it so she says on here have you ever found a perfect hair product that can never that you can never be without miel sea moss anti shedding conditioner will be your must have. It is formulated with anti-shedding properties that hydrate and fortify your hair. You will, I had that stupid, um, that stupid, uh, anti-theft thing going on. So it kind of tore, but it says something about, um, you will feel the difference just after one use. Safe for all hair types. This amazing conditioner will deliver mega, mega moisture and hydration, leaving every strand thoroughly conditioned. Pair it with the CMOS anti-shedding shampoo for amazing results and healthier hair. Of course, they tell you um, after shampooing, you need to apply the conditioner to wet hair from root to tip and leave on for 10 to 15 minutes. Rinse thoroughly for added hydration. Follow up with the CMOS leave-in conditioner. Now, y'all, I want y'all to peep this detangling process. This stuff melted. Any tangles that may have been in my hair, it just melted it. Like, it melted it away. My fingers was able to glide through the hair. This slip is so amazing. Like, you will not regret using this conditioner on your hair, especially if your hair is prone to tangles. It will help so much. Trust me. It will help. So... I'm just going to go ahead and get to detangling and let this stuff sit on my hair. I let it sit on there for about 20 minutes and then we'll come back. It's been 20 minutes and this is how my hair looking with just the conditioner on it um and it again softness curls are starting to clump together you can see um a little bit more of the curl pattern um my hair is you know moisturized very much so um it doesn't feel dry or stripped or anything so I'm going to go ahead and rinse it out and then get this deep conditioner applied to it. And uh, with the deep conditioner, it is uh, 
also part of the, um, it also cl claims to have the anti-shedding properties and it is a, a gel mask. I've never, ever used a gel mask. So um, this will be interesting, <laughs> but look at my hair. Like, oh my God, it's rinsed and it's still like nice and shiny. And it's clumping together in them curls. They just, they just showing out like they coming through. I just wanted to show you how great and easy this comb can glide through my hair. And this is just after the shampoo and the condition. I don't even, I haven't even applied the deep conditioner yet. Um, so the detangling process is just easy. And like I said, the elasticity in your hair is amazing. Your hair just bounces back like it doesn't break or anything. It's not like... It's not like too much. I don't even know what else to say, but yeah, it's great. I love it. So now I'm going to go ahead and apply this gel mask. Um, so look at look at this consistency. Like it's literally a gel. It reminds me of how um, sea moss look after it's prepared. Like when I see it in the jars when people were selling it. Um, it kind it looks just kind of jelly like that, and it's a nice thick formula. Um, this gel doesn't move. Look at it; like it's even though it's a gel, it's really it's a stiff gel. Um, the smell is similar to the conditioner; like it doesn't have like a really potent smell like the shampoo. But when somehow when all these um, products are mixed together and um, after like the lingering smell, it's really fresh. It smells just like the shampoo. So it's good. I'm pretty glad that the conditioners doesn't have as strong of a smell as the shampoo because they probably will be overpowering. Um, but the conditioner has just enough scent that when mixed with the shampoo, the lingering scent of the shampoo, your hair isn't overpowering. Like when you Sometimes when you use some products, you can walk in a room and people just automatically smell your hair because the scents are that strong. This would have, this probably would be more of if someone comes up and hug you and, you know, sniff your hair and, you know, they can smell it. It's more of a faint scent. I definitely can smell it always, but I don't think it's as powerful that everybody else in the room can smell it. All right. So let me tell you how she, um, says to enjoy it once smooth shiny hair with amazing slip look no further introducing miel sea moss anti-shedding gel mask this lightweight mask infuses brittle strands with intense hydration to restore restore health and strength safe for all hair types this nutrient nutritive formula will deep condition and envelope each strand while replenishing moisture, sea moss anti-shedding curl, I'm sorry, sea moss anti-shedding gel hair mask contains ingredients that will help to combat shedding and promote healthier hair. Use in conjunction with other sea moss products for healthy hair that will look and feel amazing. And so the directions is to apply it generously to clean wet hair, comb thoroughly from root to strands for even distribution, leave in for 20 minutes, rinse thoroughly, style as usual. And it says if you are using a steamer for deeper conditioning, do not cover your hair. The moisture, uh, the moist heat will add to the mass hydration. So... This conditioner, you probably truly can comb your hair from root to um, tip if you um, have been detangling the whole way. But, you know, of course, we don't advise by that. You should always try to comb your hair from um, tip to root just so that you can minimize your breakage. But like I say, this conditioner, it makes your hair so soft that you probably can't do it either way. But I want you to check out this deep condition. I mean, I'm this detangling that I'm doing. Like, you can literally see the moisture in this video. You can see how moisturized my hair looks and how shiny it looks. You can see how soft my hair is. You can see how easy the comb is gliding through my curls. And you know, that's that sometimes ain't easy, especially after, like, so much 
after you condition, wash and deep condition your hair. Sometimes it can be kind of hard, but this right here, it's not. So I sat under the heated cap as usual for about an hour and then um, went ahead and got myself all prepared to rinse out so I could go ahead and style my hair. So the mask heated up really, really well. It actually retained the heat really, really nicely. It made my hair feel really hydrated, really uh, felt like it really penetrated everything Um if I had any dry hair after this um, whole treatment, this whole wash day, I don't. Look at this. This is just a deep condition. It looks like I have, like I rinsed it out and have water in my hair, but I don't. It's just a deep conditioner. And it looks real, real, real wet and nice and just, just hydrated. It feels real healthy, um, real nourishing. So I think this product line definitely gives what it promises it's going to give. Just taking a minute and admiring my curls. Like I'm loving how my curls just revert um, back to, you know, just clumping together. Um, if this was like a product for a wash ago, this would be so excellent. Like I wish um, the gel was sort of a wash and go type gel. Like that would be bomb. And this is how much hair I lost during the whole process. So I would be so curious to see the results of this anti-shedding collection. And I think I'm going to do a follow-up video in about a month to see if it actually works. Okay, y'all. So I've decided I'm going to do the review like this and let you guys know what I think about the product. So, um, as you see, look at these curls. They clumping together. They look so moisturized. So clean. My hair smells so nice. It's so soft. It's manageable. Try to get the back. And, oh my God, I love this. Yeah, I love this. So, um, the shampoo. So, let's talk about that shampoo first. So, y'all know I love a good shampoo, a good sud. Like, if the shampoo suds, you pretty much got me, you know, in the door. Then, if I can detangle my hair with the shampoo in my hair, okay, <laughs> you won. I'm pretty much go buy your product again. And on top of that, if I'm not clarifying my hair, I just pretty much want um, moisture. I want manageability. I want cleanliness. I want a nice smell. Um, I want it to say what it promises it's going to do. So whether that is, it promises it's going to moisturize, and pretty much that's it. If it promises it's going to make my hair strong, and pretty much that's it. If it promises it's going to be anti-shedding, and pretty much that's it. If it uh, promises that it's going to add nutrients to my hair, and that's it. Like, I want it to do what it says it's going to do. And that shampoo pretty much delivered. Like, the shedding was minimal. You know, I got some shedding, but of course, that was already dead hair that, you know, been in, you know, my hair since you know, my week prior, you know, my style prior to that. But um, uh, the moisture is beautiful. Like it clumped my hair, my curls are popping after I shampooed, after I conditioned it. Did y'all see that leave it, that deep conditioner? I've never experienced a gel deep conditioner. So that was my first time using an, a product like that. And oh my God, that was just beautiful. Um, so let me, I'm just all over the place because I'm so impressed. Yeah, this is the anti-shedding curl put putty. This is how it looks. Um, 
So I'm just going to use this. Um, it says it's great for twists, bent, two knots, or any other styles. So I'm just going to use this to twist my hair out because I really didn't plan on actually wearing my twists out. Um, I, I needed something to like be able to tame my hair to go under a wig. I think I'm going to wear a wig for the next couple of weeks. So, um, but I'm going to use this as a twisted for twist out. But anyway, so um, that shampoo, that shampoo left my hair really clean and very moisturized and very much, um, very much <laughs> good. Like it was, I like the detangling. I like that I can finger detangle my hair a little bit. For the most part, it's nothing bad I could say about this shampoo. The suds was on point. The smell was really, really nice. It was a fresh, clean scent. Um, it left my curls clumpy. It left my curls popping during the process. Um, it actually, you know, like kind of elevated my wash. <laughs> like if I, if I, if I do say so, it kind of elevated my wash. So I really, really appreciate it that shampoo it was really nice um the conditioner i wasn't a fan of the smell of the conditioner so much the conditioner was okay but it smelled a little earthy um it was not as thick as i'm used to my hair did soak it up um and when i put it on my hair and was under the plastic cap um, I didn't think that my strands would be saturated, but when I took the cap off, it pretty much was. This conditioner was a little bit different because normally conditioners say put on, you know, after you wash and allow it to sit on your hair for what, like three to five minutes and then rinse out. Well, this conditioner said let it sit on your hair for 10 to 15 minutes. So I actually let it sit on my hair for about 30 minutes. Uh, while I finished working and then I rinsed it out and my hair was super soft after that super moisturized I could detangle it um, the rest of the way that I needed to and my curls popped they were shiny they felt conditioned they felt clean the smell at that time um, came back like smelling like the shampoo and my hair smelled super fresh um, the fragrance was really really nice um, I really appreciate the fragrance. Um, so it was definitely, definitely a good wash, you know, wash day. The deep conditioner, like I said, it was a gel. I never experienced a gel deep conditioner ever, 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 ever. Um, and so she had on there, like if you were to put it on, like it, she emphasized hydration a lot. So um, she said that if you put it on and you are using a steamer not to cover your hair because the um the heated steam i guess will help aid in hydration well i don't have a steamer but i did have my heated uh conditioning cap um so i did cover my hair because i don't want the product like on my conditioning cap but when i took that conditioning cap off that shine that I had um, on my hair was beautiful. That sheen was so beautiful. Like my hair felt super moisturized. Like so moisturized that like, I don't think I'm gonna have a problem retaining moisture this week um, on these twists. Uh, my ends look really, really nice. Look at these ends. They look really, really nice. Even though my hair needs cut, like it doesn't, I don't see any split ends on here. So um, either it's just wet and it's just like sealed up <laughs> because it's wet or it really did like help to lay the cuticles down and to lay the, the, the split ends flat. Um, yeah, so that, how did I break that? That deep conditioner uh, did this thing. Like it did, I think the whole line did exactly what it promised it was going to do um it moisturized i'm curious to see how the anti-shedding is going to work so what i plan on doing is to utilize that shampoo and conditioner system 
for the next month maybe maybe two months but definitely for the next month to see if it should uh cut down on my shedding i um showed you guys in the last clip uh at the end of the wash and condition um how much shedding i got from that and like i said i know that that was due to you know already dead hair but if it's going to cut down on my shedding I'm going to try to treat my hair as normal. I normally wash once a month. I normally style my hair once and leave it up for the week. Um, and then I go and try to wash it um, every Sunday. Um, I don't typically comb my hair through the week after I either do a wash and go, twist out, braid out, whatever. Uh, once I take it down, I just let it get as big as it can get by Sunday. Um, if it for whatever reasons happens to frizz up or I don't like the way that it looked me at week, I would just throw it in a poop. I still don't really comb it out. I may pick it a little bit just to give it some volume. Um, you know, when I put the poof up, but I usually don't go through and like detangle and comb real well. So that's why I like to show um in the beginning of the videos before i comb how my hair look and that's why it's so important to me to be able to detangle my hair um throughout the whole process of the wash day because i don't comb my hair out all week i just allow it to be because i try i'm trying to grow my hair and i don't want to manipulate it too much so that's the reason why i just really try not to comb my hair that much if i can help it so Thank you so much for watching and until next time, embrace your exquisite tresses. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to like this video if you like it and tag Miel in this video and let her know that I did a review on her product and I really, 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 really love it. Um, I hope you guys go out and buy it if you haven't already tried it. Uh, if your hair looks like it's my texture, um, has some of the properties of my hair, I, I think you will enjoy this. If you, especially if you enjoy detangling during the whole wash session. So I'll talk to you soon to the next video. Bye.